Sometimes I never ask you in Hoover was Fletcher to clean up. What kind of what was behind that? There? Well, we were facing some right-handed pitchers, and I thought Fletcher had been swinging the bat extremely well. You know, tomorrow we face a lefty. I may, I may adjust it a little bit, uh-huh. but. Uh, and really, it took our lineup basically to left, right, left, right, left, right, pretty much all the way through. So that was the thinking there. Hey, Dave, uh, you know, uh, Trevor obviously had a rough start at Auburn, and then he had a rough first game against Ole Miss, and then really since then he's been lights out. What, what do you think happened? I just think it was just about uh, probably more mental than anything and pitching on the road a little bit, uh, SEC, maybe had that uh, little bit of a lull after a really good start. Uh, I think his first three or four starts were really, really good here. So, um, you know, I just think he needed to, to experience and fail a little bit, and now he's he, he feels like he's the guy. How close did you come to pull him out of that Ole Miss game, and then he gave you some great innings after that rough start? Yeah, he, gave up, he gave up four in the first Ole Miss, and, uh, you know, he was struggling. Uh, there was a couple of reasons. We wanted – we were down four, and, we didn't, you know, we didn't feel great about – going through eight eight more innings with in using our whole bullpen so we just figured hey we're going to let him figure it out and we got to climb our way back in we ended up losing i think four to one i mean we had plenty of chances to win that game and he you know he he, he just kind of turned the corner there and ever since then he's been pretty good the other day you said third base still not sure it, it, since you're closer any more of a decision yeah i'll probably go with kenley tomorrow just uh go with the better you know, the better, you know, really defender athletically. He's a little quicker, got a little better range, a little stronger arm, and, uh, you know, try to get this game off to a, a good start. I know you talked about the Oral Roberts lefty a little bit the other day, but what more do you know about him? You know, just watching video and talking to, you know, to other coaches, just uh, crafty lefty with a good arm, 87 to 90 for the most part. Um, keeps the ball down, moves it around a lot, and, uh, Obviously, he's awful good. He's got 11 wins, and there's not too many pitchers in the country uh, that have 11 wins and only a couple of losses. So he's he's pitched very consistent all year for him. So left hand alter your lineup in as far as uh, maybe maybe just a little bit the order, but it'll be the same the same hitters. You know, we we've done a pretty good job against lefties, and our left-handed hitters have you know stayed in there and, and done a nice job against lefties all year so i haven't pl- platooned much at all this year with this team they our left-handed hitters have shown that that they can you know they can get the job done if you keep sticking with eric call because he was another one that struggled early oh yeah no eric is one of our he's, he's one of our hottest hitters and best players right now and he hits right-handed really just as well as it does left it probably the more lefties he sees the better he gets Just anybody team you compare them to. Just that uh, you know, talking to other coaches that they're they're very physical. They're an older team, and uh, you know they can really swing the bat. And they've got a you know they've got a really good team, and uh, nothing we didn't already know or expect. They're they're going to be a big challenge. What about the uh, Oklahoma State? Missouri haven't State? haven't done anything on them. We played Oklahoma State. You know we've got more information, updated stats, know who's hurt and who's not. But you know the same on Missouri State. Uh, you know we've we've done some things on them, but. Really, more than anything, we're just trying to really stay focused on Oral Roberts. Feel like any regional tougher in the country than this one? I don't. I don't. You know, I don't think that maybe the the country knows about all these teams. But to me personally, I don't think there's a better regional, you know, top to bottom in the country. I don't know how there could be when you just look at the numbers, the offense, the defense, the the wins, and what these teams have accomplished. You know, in league, out of league, I don't see how there's a better regional. Okay. Thanks.